What is up, Pyromaniacs? Pyrostasis here. We are back in the world of Feed the Beast Horizons. I actually got the name right for once. Yay, I'm so proud of myself. I'm so proud. All right, we are going to be setting up, hopefully, some new engines over the next couple episodes. I'm about tired of these stupid freaking things. I hate them. These are evil. They're horrible. They're horrible. And I hate them. I hate them so much. I just, I think that the thing I hate the most is how long it takes. It takes almost 30 minutes to charge these little things up to 100 uh, micro Teslas, whatever the hell a micro Tesla is. It's like somebody took, uh, took Tesla, what's his face, and Nikolai Tesla and like miniaturized him, turned him into a damn micro machine. It just, I don't know, it just, it just drives me crazy. So what we're going to be doing, and we've been kind of working on this for a bit, but what we're going to be doing is we're going to be aiming for these engines right here. This is the performance engine. Now, we're kind of on a gap here. Um, you can see this right here produces 256. And these right here produce 131. So it's going to be right around twice the power. So we're going to get twice the power output if we can switch over to this engine. So the problem with this engine over that engine is, number one, it needs ethanol. Ethanol is kind of a pain in the ass. The other thing is it needs, um, it needs, uh, oh my God, I haven't, I'm on a 13 hour stream right now so far, so my brain may be a little scattered. It needs blaze powders. There we go. So you got to mix that in there to make the right mixture for it to, ro to, to work correctly. So we're going to start working on the part uh, that's easy to make, and that's the fermenter. So we're gonna come over here to our little machine and we're gonna look up the fermenter real quick. Fermenter. Now let me make sure I've got all of my crap here. We will eventually, I swear, get a, uh, what's it called? Okay. We will eventually get a ME system set up. I I promise, one of these days, in the, in the, in the distant future, in a galaxy far, far away, we will get some of that set up. We're currently trying to process uh, as much of our iron in uh, from ingots and such into the into this, but it just takes so much bloody power. And apparently, there's a there's a nasty little I don't know. I think it's an exploit. I'm not sure. Whoops. Nope. No. Nope, no. Nope, wrong ingots. I think it's an exploit. There's a nasty little setup you can use to get unlimited um, energy with uh, rotary craft using pulleys and shit, but. I don't really like the look of it, and you know, you guys know how I am. I, for whatever reason, when it comes to cheating and such, I just I kind of have a problem with it. So I, I just I just don't get down for it. Even though even if it's not cheating, I have a problem with it if that makes sense. So if it's like sketchy, it's like eh, I'll pass. And this is kind of one of those sketchy things. Uh, I may show it on my uh, my channel, just so those of you guys who you know have no moral values, you dirty heathens. Uh, I may show it for you guys, just so you guys can find... What the fuck? Okay, I was about to be like, what the hell? It is in there! It is perfect! Why are you giving me crap? Alright, this right here is our fermenter. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now I'm going to set the fermenter, I believe... Well, no, I think we have to feed it in through its back. All of these things require you to feed it in from the back. It's terrible. And I'm not doing it over there. That's just too loud. Alright, we're going to do it this way. We're gonna do it this way. It's gonna be ugly, and I don't care. It's gonna be ugly. All right, we're gonna place you right there. You can see it's little buttholes right there. That's where it wants its stuff to come in. Now, the way this works, you can see the targets up here. You've got yeast, and there's another target you can change. I I can't change it right now, but there is, there is another option here. Um, the two options with the fermenter. Let's pull it up. It is under here and here. Uh, you can make sludge, and you can make yeast. So yeast is the first product I believe that we need to make. So the fermenter is how you produce ethanol, blah, blah, blah. To make yeast, place sugar in the top slot and dirt on the bottom. To make sludge, put yeast in the top and plant matter on the bottom. All right, so that means we need some sugar. Now, thankfully, my God, I hope I'm right on this. Wait, I think we had a ton of them down here. I think we have a ton. We need to find some sugar cane so we can get some sugar. Now, obviously, this is going to be a whole new pain in the ass. I mean, this is this is going to be a legendary pain in the ass. Um, oh man, we really have got to sort this, and it sucks because I can actually alphabetize it here. 
But there's no way for me to alphabetize it. Wait, was that sugar on the top? That was not. There was no way that was sugar on the top. All right, screw it. I don't care anymore. All right, let's go upstairs and let's see if we can find some sugar cane. I think I've got some planted outside. I'm not sure. Let's see if I can find. Let's see if I can find some. I know we've got some in the chest somewhere, because we were we were chopping some of them down. There's some, not much, but a few. There's some more. Apparently we've got it all over the damn place. Ah, uh, there's some more. As you can see, they're kind of just scattered all over the place. Uh, nothing there. And I think we've got a ton outside. I want to say somebody was growing them. Now, JJ may have, have snarked them. Damn it. Damn it, Bobby. Alright, so we're gonna... Here's what we're gonna do. And see, the prop... This is the real the real bitch of the thing. Uh, okay. Right over here, this is where we're gonna end up setting this stuff up. Why are there holes over here? What the hell, man? Somebody's been... Met, yep. See, normally I would just let that go, but, you know, the OCD... And, and I think Oppie's been doing shit. She's up to something. She's mad at me because I told her I was going to lock her in my dungeon. Apparently she didn't like that. People, you know, people would love to be locked in my dungeon. People need to tell Oppie how lucky she would be to be locked in my dungeon. Um, anyways, uh, I told her I was going to lock her in my dungeon. She didn't get, she didn't like that too much. And so she tried to kill me the other day and she screwed up. I saw through it. Her, her meager attempts at murdering me failed. Oh my God, there's so many. There we go. All right, OCD people have been satisfied. We're good. Well, not quite. They're, they're getting satisfied. We're getting close. Dude, this algae stuff is like... It's like AIDS in the water, man. Okay, watch, watch. Okay, you see? There's three spots there. You watch this. By the time we come back, at least... Oh, you son of a bitch. Yeah! Gotcha. All right, of course. Now it's not going to do it. This stuff spreads like a plague, man. I'm telling you, it is like a plague. It's everywhere. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're gonna play with this right here for now. Eventually, I'll make a better farm. But uh, for now, that ought to do. Uh, and then what we're gonna do? I'm gonna cheat a little bit here. I know some of you guys are gonna hate this, but I'm just doing this because whoops, because of the way we have the server set up. And chunk. There you are. There you are, Cletus. There you are. All right, we're gonna put you right here. And we're going to turn you to nine chunk show lasers. Is that good? That'll do. Hide lasers. Perfect. Toss it. Awesome. All right. Out of creative. And they actually... Oh, God. Really? Really? You can't let me get out of cheat mode? You really want to hit the cheater? Is that really what you want to do, buddy? You thought that was a good move? Or was, was that her? Did you just bust me in the face? Woman? You better be nice to me. Don't make me come up there. I will come up there. Ah, she's shooting at me. All right. Well, we're gonna we're gonna let that stuff grow. Ah, quit it, woman. Quit it. Quit it. Stop it. She's so mean, man. She is so mean. She's like that uh, that little boy in like the third grade who's always pulling on the girl's ponytail in front of him. She's vicious, man. Vicious. I'm telling you what. All right. So now that we've got at least some reeds, we don't have a lot. We don't have a lot at all, but we're going to turn these reeds into more reed. Oh, that's paper. Shit. How do I turn it into sugar cane? Or sugar. There we go. Wow. Been a while. I don't play much vanilla. And, you know, most of the time, me not playing vanilla doesn't really show through, but occasionally it does. And uh, a lot of times it's with some of these more basic farming recipes and stuff like that. I may have to start up a vanilla series just to bring myself back up to speed. Because my last... I think my last vanilla series was in 2011. <laughs> it was like 1.25 back in the good old days. So we, 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 whoops, we probably could use... A refresher on some of the stuff. It also doesn't help that I only play modded Minecraft, uh, like Tech It, Technic, 
feed the beast and stuff like that. So because I only play those types, oh come on, I do miss out on uh, a lot of the new changes until they're not new, and then by the time they roll out, people have stopped talking about them. And so, you know, since people have stopped talking about them, I, I don't know what they are. And then when they finally do get to my version, you know, it's like, oh yeah, yeah, that, that cool pony thing you guys have been talking about for like the past month. Yeah, I have no idea how that works at all. And then of course the people who play, play it regularly, like, oh my god, you're an idiot. I'm like, yes, yes, I know. Mama said I was special. Alright, there we go. So now we've got a decent amount of dirt. <laughs> and I don't think canola oil is going to work. Oh, one more thing. Yeah. I know saplings work for sure. I know saplings work for sure. Now the reason we're going to use... This is the whole reason we have the tree farm set up over here that we still haven't gotten working yet. Uh, because I'm mainly getting just owned on power. Like completely owned. Alright, there's a stack. There we go. That ought to be plenty. That ought to be plenty. We should be good with this. Alright. We should be able to make at least some crystals. And we ought to be fine. <laughs> Krillic's like, I do vanilla and I'm awesome. That's fine, Krillic. That's fine. Making me look bad. I see how it is. Making me look bad on the stream, bro. That's just hateful, dude. I thought we were friends. Thought we were friends. Alright. So the nice thing about this machine is it doesn't require much power. It doesn't require much power at all. In fact, one DC electric engine right here can more than fuel it. In fact, it actually provides a little too much power, which is fine because we don't care. Honey Badger don't care. We flip that on, you can see it's getting full power. So what we need to do for this, if I have my memory correct, oh, no, 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 we got to heat this thing, don't we? I think we have to heat this thing. You can see it's temperature. Uh, let's try this. Do, do I have to eat it? I think if I... It's in the green zone. I think if I move it a little bit forward... Here, let's try this. Oh, shut up! God, you're loud. Let's try this. This way it's right in front of the thing. Alright, and then we'll just put you here. There we go. Let me just break this. I want to see if that makes it a little warmer. Not really. Okay, let's do this. Let's break this. And we're kind of playing around with this. The, the thing is, yeast obviously wants some heat. Well, maybe not obviously. I don't know. Some of you guys who are familiar with yeast and the yeast process, maybe make your own beer at home or something. Um, you'll be familiar with this. Uh, some of you guys won't. All right, there we go. What we're going to do is we're going to jump over here. Grab some of that netherrack. So swap you out with that. We're going to put you right there. Now the nice thing about this is this stuff will burn forever. Oh, please tell me we have some flint. Oh, god dang it. There we go. Please, for the love of everything holy, tell me we have some flint. If we don't have flint, at least tell me we have some gravel. Come on now. Come on now. Alright, you know what? I don't care. I don't care. I think I can do it this way. Ah, shit. Yeah. Let's uh, let's clear out some of the stuff. Let's put some of these ingots and stuff away. There we go. We freed up a little room. Yes, I will get into me system one of these days. I promise. Uh, we're going to go ahead and open you up. We're going to click you off. We're just going to put you in here. I believe this will turn it all into gravel. I think. Ah, damn it. It's sand. Terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Uh, okay, we're gonna have to go find some gravel then, I guess. Unless I've got some flint upstairs. Now we did ignite. We did ignite an engine, or not an engine, the uh, the portal. So I know we've got one. It's probably in our crate. But like I said, the problem with the crate is so many different things can be handled by that crate, and it's random every time you open it. You never know what you're gonna get. Uh, I'm not seeing it there. Not seen it there. Here in a zombie. Hopefully the zombie doesn't come and pay me a visit. That would be bad. There's charcoal. Oh, come on. Oh, yes. Ownage. All right, we're going back down. Going back down. Outstanding. Whee. All right. Now we got to get that, uh, that thing we got back. 
Now I'm hoping we can hit the sweet spot with this because the, the warmer you get it, obviously, the faster yeast will cook. Because I, I think it's like a bacteria. I, I mean, I may be showing my stupidity here, but I think it's a bacteria. I may be wrong. I know it's a chemical reaction that requires heat. There we go. I can see that temperature's coming up a bit. The goal is you want it warm, but not so warm that it's in the red. So yellow might be okay. Ah, uh, damn it, it's getting too hot. It's getting too hot, I think. Stop going up. Yeah, that's pretty warm right there. That may be too hot. That may be too hot. In fact, I'm pretty sure it is too hot. And that's just a little fire. So I can probably put it out and let it cool for a minute. And then I can put you here and I can put the sugar on top. And I think we need water here. Yeah, we definitely need some water. So we're gonna do, what is it? Uh, where is our little, all right, we're gonna change the setup here. You know, I said we weren't going to go over next to the other setup. Yeah, well, I lied. We are. We're totally going over there. I don't need a wooden hoe. Is there anything else I need to pick up here? Uh, you can have your spider eyes. Well, no, you can have your sand block. I don't want your stupid sand block. And then we need one liquid duct. Just one. Do we have a liquid duct we can get rid of over here, maybe? Anything we can get rid of, maybe? Just possibly? Do we have any liquid ducts in here? I mean, I can make another one, I'm pretty sure. Can't we do it with these? Isn't it just electrum? There it is. Those are energy conduits. Fluid ducts, so we just need copper. Uh, yeah, I think we've got copper, right? we got copper? Yes, we do. All right, let's, uh, how do I have so much crap in my inventory? It's like, no matter what, I always have a fucking full in Did I really have 24 flint on me the whole time? Oh my god. I had 24 flint on me the whole time. The whole time. My god, I am special. I am absolutely freaking special. How I get out of bed in the morning is a surprise. I, I, I don't understand, man. I don't understand. All right, here we go. Let's pop that. Bam, bam. There we go. We got some more fluid ducts. Beautiful. Okay. Oh, acrylic gave me 24 flint. Okay, I didn't notice that, acrylic. You made me feel like I was stupid, and you gave it to me. That means that means you made me feel stupid. You're so mean. You're so mean, acrylic. Well, by by trying to help me, you made me feel dumb. Thanks, buddy. Alright. Then we just need to attach this like that. We need our wrench, which we have right here. Let's try this one more time. Alright, so we got that. Flip that on. Uh, you know, I'm going to try one other thing real quick. Let's try this. I want to see if I can cool the thing down just a bit. And I'm going to go ahead and bust this out as well. I want to see if it can detect fire a block away from it. Because you guys saw the temperature difference uh, when we when we lit it up. Now, is that going to heat it up? No. And you can see right here, it is one block away. Just one block away, and there's no heat exchange. So, ow, damn it. There's probably a heater block in this mod. I, I bet... Oh, God, am I going to burn to death? Okay, no. There is probably a heater uh, setup in this. I'm almost positive. All right, put that up. Where did it go? Okay, there it is. And it does not seem to be cooking much. Turn that off. Oh, it's because I haven't turned the damn thing on yet. You can see, we're getting some. And it's producing. Now we're in the green. You can see it's producing pretty quickly. I may just want to leave it in the green. Here I was trying to speed things up. I may do just fine leaving it just like that. Yeah, as long as it doesn't drop anymore. Don't drop anymore. There we go. Damn, that's fast. Okay, so as long as it's in the green, that's where you want it to be. That's where you want it to be. Well, so this is going to give us 22 yeast. We're going to take the yeast out here in just a second. Pop that out. Pull this out. Put you up top. That should change this here in a second. And then we put these on the bottom. 
and for some reason it's stolen. There we go. I can see the sludge. Now this up here is supposed to change. I don't know why it's not changing. Either way, you can see this is producing. Now this isn't producing as fast. So I'm going to fire it up just a bit. Just a bit. There it goes. Now we're going to put that fire out real quick. So it's kind of a balance. You can see that each of these has a different speed chemically. And I think we're slowing down again. Yeah, we're slowing down big time. All right, so yellow is too hot. So this kind of likes being in the upper green portion, while the other one likes kind of being anywhere in the green area, and it's happy. Anywhere in the green spot. So this is sludge right here. Now sludge right here, it, its use right here is we go and smelt it. You can put it, turn it into ethanol crystals. Now I don't think there's any way for us to smelt this in a fashion where we get any extra, at least as far as I'm aware of. There we go. So that's giving us 40 crystals. We can go ahead and turn that off so that shuts up. All right, we'll come over here to the furnace. We're gonna slap this in here. And then that should give us our ethanol crystals here, probably right here. Yep. And these right here are the fuel we need. So what we'll be doing in the next episode, um, we're probably gonna turn, we're gonna make the engine. Once we made the engine, uh, we're gonna try and get a decent supply of these. Thankfully, the uh, saplings isn't a problem. The issue we've got is uh, gonna be the sugar cane and the blaze powders. Uh, blaze powder shouldn't be too hard. I just got to get up there and, you know, kind of kick ass and take names on some blazes for a bit. Eventually, we can hopefully uh, find a way to automate that setup to where it's not too nasty. And then between the two, uh, we should we should be good. We should be good. So, anyways, for those of you watching on YouTube, hopefully you guys liked this episode. If you did, slap that like button. Make sure you subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next clip.